Hello, what I have here is a 1908 Columbia BC graphophone. Has a huge 24 inch by 37 inch horn on it, which goes to the uh, huge Higgum diaphragm, which amplified the sound of the record via an amber wheel and a uh, vulcanized rubber belt, which caused friction, which amplified the sound. This machine has a triple spring motor. I believe it was designed by Frank Kraps, uh, initially used on the Columbia commercial graphophone, here adapted for the BC. Um, I think it was also used in the graphophone grand. It's a huge machine, very heavy, about 55 pounds. Has a huge lid to go over the mechanism. And I've got it standing on a very nice cabinet, which holds 216 cylinders. And what I've done is I have filled it up with two minute indestructible cylinders because that's what I love. Holds quite a few cylinders, as you can see. Quite an impressive setup, but not half as impressive as the sound this machine puts out. Nice little collection of cylinders there. Enough for many hours of enjoyment. The uh, cabinet has nice uh, paw feet on it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a cylinder and listen to it. Um, you can give a listen to the motor when it starts. <coughs> you hear that sound? That's the friction wheel. Uh, starting the friction on the diaphragm. <coughs> Once it starts, it's there. So I'm going to lower the stylus. And give you an idea of what this thing can do.
I didn't talk while the record was playing because I would have had to shout. This thing is built for um, opera houses and for concert halls and definitely um, will blow, your, blow the cobwebs out of your ears. Uh, it is the loudest two minute cylinder machine I have ever heard. I hope you liked it. Thanks.